Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Today it is my Premier League prediction for week 6. Uh, even though this week I ain't fully completed yet, obviously can't have behind me my team plan tonight. And if you can't tell who, who the team is, it's quite a nice album. Go up against Southampton. Now both these teams are in my week 6 predictions. Um, as I said, I no longer have a pick of who comes out. I let one of my family members do it. Um, basically, pick them out of the bucket. Um, I ain't gonna lie. And these six pictures ain't the biggest six um, that I could have possibly came out, but it's the six I'm gonna do. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first one is. Liverpool um, versus Southampton. Now, as I've just said, these six, one of these teams play tonight. The filming of this, so you know, without actually seeing them play yet, and um, and then obviously seeing Liverpool beat Tottenham, um, I'll go back and for an easy Liverpool win. Um, I'm gonna go for about three 0 uh, at Anfield. Um, not, no disrespect to Southampton, I really can't see a way out for Southampton, uh, especially at Anfield. I mean, I went up there and Liverpool could have had the one, just more, uh, more than a one, sorry. But they didn't, and I think uh, Liverpool will probably do the same thing. Um, now, the second game is Burnley versus Bournemouth. Now Burnley lost again this weekend, Bournemouth easy victory over Leicester. But I'll ask what they thought when they till went uh, till Leicester got two goals back. Um, and then Bournemouth won it four two. Against an uncomfortable Burnley at the minute. Burnley have uh, missed uh, a lot of points. At this stage of the season, five games with only one point. Um, I'm going to battle for Bournemouth win. Um, you know, it's pretty tough down there. Uh, as I said to you, I did my uh, Premier League predictions. If you did, it would be in the playlist below. Um, now, I don't think Burnley strengthened enough to play European football and Premier League football. And it looks like at the net, I've just been proved a little bit right. Um, it does take a lot of money to find Europe and the Premier League, but Burnley's been strengthened enough. Or we'll even get the players in. Uh, I think they got one or two in over the summer. I might be wrong, put me, put me right from one Burnley fan. Um, but as I said, I'm going to back Bournemouth and I'm going to go for a 3 0 win. Uh, the next one, Cardiff Main City at the Cardiff City Stadium. Um, now, obviously, I'm going to go with everyone else here. Um, I'm going to back a Main City away win. Um, now, uh, sorry to Cardiff, but Main City, no one can see past Main City um, at this because it's like, um, then you've got, you know, the likes of Aguero, uh, Sane, and all them, so, as I said, I'll go back it for a City away win, and I'm going to go for a 4-0 win for City. Now, West Ham versus Chelsea, um, West Ham picked up their first win uh, against Everton, unsurprisingly to some. Um, I can't see West Ham doing over Chelsea. Um, I thought Everton weren't really up to scratch with the game. Um, two major mess ups uh, from Everton to for West Ham two goals. One was a long ball and then the other was Jordan Pickford passed it out straight to a West Ham player. Um, 
But as I said, I can't see West Ham doing anything over Chelsea. So I'm going to go for a Chelsea away win again. And I'm going to go with a 2 0 scoreline. Uh, the next one, Fulham over beat on Watford. Uh, Watford lost this weekend. Um, I think Fulham lost as well. Um, but for this one, I'm going to call it a draw. I think that uh, defeat over the United uh, for Watford. I can't see them really going on beating Fulham at Claywood Cottage. Um, so I'm going to go with a one on scoreline um, for that one. Um, and then, yet yeah, again, my local team came up in this position. Um, as I said at the start of the video, you know who it is. Um, and, they, and we go off against Tottenham. Um, now, yet yeah, again, Tottenham lost to Liverpool. Uh, look nervy, look edgy. Um, and as I said, Brighton still got to play yet. But, I know if you guys say, well, if I go for a home win, it's because I'm a Brighton fan, that's not the case. I'll go on my personal opinion. For this video, I always do it from a natural fan point of view. I never take sides. Um, but for that one, I'm going to go with last season's scoreline at the MX, and that was a one all scoreline. Uh, with a sudden goal and then a penalty to Brighton. Um, but I'm going to go for the same thing in this one. Um, but anyway guys, this is the end of the video. Guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.